Hi guys, so now we have know how to use the custom interface to define the checklist for the child class to implement. So now we are going to look at one very very important interface that Java provides us. So the name is comparable. Comparable interface only has one method which is compare to. But this is exceptionally important when you want to compare different objects of the same type of different types. So in this case, this is a class cat. And my implement, um, my comparable is with the arrow parentheses, I can say, yeah. So this one is indicating the target that we want to compare to. So cat can be compared to cat. Fairly logic, right? So they will only have the H as a parameter. And this compare to, I will need to override it and setting the rules of me wanting to sort the cats out. So in this case, this dot H, if it is less than the target H, I will return a negative value. So negative value means the current item is smaller than the target item. If they are equal, then this is equal. Lah. If it is uh, larger than the target, then I will return a positive value, indicate that the current one is bigger than the target one. So this is the standard for the rules for comparing the object of the same classes. Cat. So now I can do the array.sort As you can see now cats 0 is 21 and cats 1 is 18 So if I want to sort it I can actually uh, Let me try to print the things out So the things I want to print out is the cats 0.edge So what do you think will be the result? As we have already sorted it right so supposedly the things although it starts from 21 to 18 but it should be already sorted there's 18 to 21 so the result expected is 18 in this case well yeah we got the 18 here it means that our comparable has been success successfully implemented you can actually interfere with the um, rules of comparison as long as you want to by uh, for example if I want to get the larger uh, get things in the uh, descending order yeah this is not a good practice uh, but this will actually help you to inverse the result right yeah you get a 21 here now so a lot of ways you can play with comparable but comparable is convenient that it can also be used to put a collection of parent classes objects to sort it within one line using the standard library arrays.sort. What is it for the comparable interface? Yeah, hope this can help you. See ya.